It is time for School Spirit. We are in Tinley Park with the Thunderbolts. Dana Kozlov is at Victor J. Andrew High School, Andrew High School for short. Good morning, Dana. Uh, I see you have not yet put on your letterman's jacket. No, and I haven't picked up a pair of pom-poms yet either, Brad. Probably not going to happen, but we are back well, in the no, gymnasium. No, 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 all right, maybe later. Not now. Uh, well, we got okay. other things to talk about now, Brad. Oh, fine. Mainly, mainly, mainly okay. pickleball that oh, I... you love, 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 love so much, as you said pickleball. once to me on the air. But we're going to talk about pickleball not in the way you think. I mean, yes, some people are playing pickleball right now. Some of these Andrew students, they're out this morning, uh, you know, slamming the rackets around. But what we want to talk to you about is a really unique paddle what am I going to say paddle making project partnership here at the school and to start explaining it I'm with Jeff Cassidy who is the wood shop teacher so Jeff good morning, good morning. tell me about first of all you're holding a homemade if you will yeah, sure. you know pa paddle so tell me about the program here yeah. you know paddle making who it benefits etc yeah uh, so here at Andrew this is my second year doing a partnership with our Ultimo program with our wood students and our special needs students to be involved in the wood shop and make something collaborative uh, to help out raise awareness as well as have a little fun, build some skills in the wood shop, and come up with something really awesome to uh, auction off at the end to raise that money for awareness for any kind of special needs. So some of your, your wood shop students actually work with some of your diverse learners to make these paddles. Yeah, one to one we work, uh, so I have a wood shop student uh, with our special needs students, one to one they're making these paddles by hand, uh, custom made, and then we took them up to the art room, had them paint them, uh, and then we had a pickleball tournament at the end. And then when you auction them off, that money goes back into the woodshop program. Yeah, it goes back to the woodshop program for next year. Uh, we're going to have a nice, awesome program for next year, something different uh, to make to sell for next year as well. I think that's great. I want to talk to Prest sure. Preston Krejcik. Did I say that right? Yep. All right. Uh, anyway, you're one of the students. It's your second year, and you help with this paddle project. Do you love it? Oh, I do. of course I do. What's your favorite part about, you know, about it and working with some of the, you know, diverse learners? Um, it's just really just like having the opportunity to help people and just give back to the community. Like knowing you're like kind of making a change. It just feels good inside. That's great. And you know, I just want to, before I sign off here, I just want to show you, again, all of the, not all of them, but all of the wood paddles you see out there being held by, okay, there's a few, but being held by these uh, pickleball players, all of them were made in wood shop with Jeff and Preston. So it's one of the very unique programs here at Andrew High School. And uh, you know, Brad, if you and I ever get on a court, maybe I'll see if I can buy one of the paddles for a good cause, and I'll use it when I take you on. But for well, now, back to you. Uh, it's so interesting that you said that, because if I was there, I would be playing pickleball, and you used to be in the pom-pom squad, and you are now threatening to not pom-pom. So Yes. Uh, we'll take that up next hour, Dana. You and me. <laughs> Thank you. All right, um, I will go find a pair of pom poms. Um, okay. Please, bye -bye. please, and can, hey, get uh, get one of those rackets. Yeah, get <laughs> one of those rackets. I love it. That's so cool. Okay, thanks, Dana.